Good morning students. Once again, a warm welcome to the new session of our Max class. In today's class, we are going to discuss the continuation of our third chapter, Measurement. So all of you, please take your notebook and textbook. Get ready for the class. So students, done? Okay, let us get into our class. So students, we were discussing our third chapter measurement, right? So we covered the topics like the measurement of length and also the conversion, addition and subtraction of length. And also we covered the measurement of weight, the conversion, addition and subtraction of weight. So in today's class, we came into the last portion of our third chapter. Now let us study the measurement story. So let us start with the first one. So please get ready to write the measurement story. So the first one is a shopkeeper sold 83 liter 250 milliliter of mustard oil and 78 liter 400 milliliter of sunflower oil. How many liter of oil did he sell? So the question we have is the total of the oil the shopkeeper sell. Okay, in order to find the total of the uh, oil, what we have to do students? Yes, we have to add the amounts. Okay, now let us look what should be the first statement. So, the information we get from the question is the shopkeeper sold 83 liter 250 milliliter of mustard oil. So, the first statement should be the amount of mustard oil. So, the amount of mustard oil is 83 liter and 250, 250 milliliter. Okay. Now, the information we get from the question is the and 78 liter 400 milliliter of sunflower oil. So, the next statement should be the amount of sunflower oil salt. So, it is 78 liter and 400 milliliter. So, the final statement should be total amount of oil the shopkeeper sold. Okay. So, in order to find the total amount of oil did he find, what we have to do students? Say loudly. Yes, we have to add this. So, can you find it by yourself? The litre section and the milliliter section. So, the amount of mustard oil is 83. 250 milliliter. Okay. And the amount of the sunflower oil is 78 liter and 400 milliliter. Okay. So, we have to add this. 0 plus 0, 0. 5 plus 0, 5. 4 plus 2, 6. 3 plus 8 is 11. So, 1 here, 1 on the top of this 8. So, 8 plus 7, 15 plus that one, 16. So the answer is 161 liter, 650 milliliter. Okay. So the total amount of the oil he sold is 161 liter and 650 milliliter. So please write this on your notebook. All of you done students? Now let us move to the next measurement story. A pan contain 2 litre 635 milliliter of soup. If 1 litre 320 milliliter of soup is 
pint the quantity of soup left so the question we have is find the quantity of soup left in order to find how much is left with us what we have to do students yes we have to subtract right so the first statement should be the total amount of soup in the pan okay it is 2 liter and 635 milliliter okay now what is the second statement should uh, students can you guess so the information we get from the question is the so the second statement should be the amount of soup is 1 liter and 320 milliliter okay now what is the third statement so the amount of soup left in the pan okay now we have to find the amount of soup is left in the pan in order to find the amount of soup left in the pan what we have to do is we have to subtract now let us check how to solve this the total amount of soup in the pan is 2 liter and 635 ml and the amount of soup 1 liter and 320 ml now let us find the amount of soup left so we have to subtract let us subtract 1 liter and 320 ml from 2 liter and 635 ml okay so the 5 minus 0 is equal to 5 3 minus 2 1 6 minus 3 3 2 minus 1 1 so the amount of soup left is 1 liter and 315 ml liter in the exercise number 3.13 A and B section. I say homework for you. Okay. So enough for today, students. I hope you understood the measurement of capacity. So today we learned the measurement of capacity. Don't forget to do your homeworks and also WhatsApp to the school WhatsApp number. Thank you, students.